The female reproductive system is made up of the external and internal genital organs. The breasts are also sometimes considered part of the reproductive system. The vagina is a tube-like muscular organ that connects the external genital organs to the uterus. It is the passageway for sperm to reach the egg in the uterus, for menstrual bleeding, and through which babies are delivered during birth. The uterus is a thick-walled organ in the middle of the pelvis that functions to support the developing fetus. Its muscular walls contract during labor to push the baby out, and the cervical canal widens to let the baby through. The two fallopian tubes extend from the uterus towards the ovaries, where eggs and the female sex hormones are produced. During puberty, the ovaries increase the production of estrogen and progesterone causing a sequence of changes that include breast development and menstruation. The fallopian tubes are where the egg is fertilized by the sperm. The fertilized egg is propelled to the uterus by the hair-like projections that line the fallopian tubes. The female breasts are composed of milk-producing glands surrounded by fatty tissue. During the 24th week of pregnancy, a woman's body produces hormones that stimulate the production of milk which is secreted by the glands and flows through ducts and out through the nipples. <laughs>